Hello Virgos, so this is your weekly reading. I'm going to start with the tarot. So universe, what's the current energy between Virgos and the person that's on Virgo line? Seven of Cups and the Lovers. Hmm. Okay, so some of you, a lot of you guys are keeping your options open. This person... Yeah, you're keeping your options open or this is them too. Or both of you guys are doing the same thing. You see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that's on Virgo's mind, what would you like to say to Virgo? Okay, so the Empress and the Three of Swords in reverse. Okay, this is what I'm getting. I feel like this is someone who want you to still be with them even though they have a third person. Okay, or they were trying to make you a third person. Um... Yeah, because for majority of you guys, it's just this person's a cheater. They like they're not monogamous type of person. Um, universe, the person that's on Virgo mind. What does this person keep in hidden from Virgo? Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind. What does this person keep in hidden from Virgo? Eight of Cups. Yeah, so this is someone who still want to have like they still want to be with you, but it's like they emotionally checked out. Okay, but they don't want this to be over. Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind. How does this person feel about Virgo? Seven of Swords. Wow. So this person feel like they can keep on doing them. Okay. This is someone who just need help. Okay. Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind. What is their true feelings for Virgo? Universe, three of Pentacles. Again, they still want to be with you, but still deal with so and so basically, or still deal with multiple people. Universe, the person that's on Virgo mind. What is their intentions with Virgo? the star to reconnect with you and to see if you don't this is someone who's trying to see if you are going to allow bs behavior okay universe the person that's on virgo mind what actions will they take with virgo the nine of wands and the tower universe clap for the nine of wands nine of cups so yeah, I feel like with them, they are going to be very persistent of trying to get your attention. I feel like the Nine of Wands, this is about being guarded, but I feel like they're trying to see if they can block you from moving on, okay? I feel like this person might be even popping up on you, like at your front doorsteps, okay? I feel like it's like they don't want you to do, the, like, do what they're doing to you, to them, basically. That's what I'm getting. Um, universe, clarify the Nine of Cups, Six of Swords. Ace of Wands, Universe Club by Six Swords, Ace of Wands, Five of Wands, Queen of Swords. Yeah, they don't want you to keep your options open or basically behaving like them. They want you to just be loyal, you know, give them girlfriend, boyfriend, wife, husband benefits without them doing the same. Okay, so this is someone who just trifling, okay? very much trifling um i i see that they probably even worse because this is someone who think that you will allow this person back in your life okay that's what i'm getting so this person's sign could be a gemini a pisces a scorpio aquarius or aries let's see what else i'm getting for you guys First, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? So there is repentance. So there is unparalleled and have no fear. Yeah, so this is someone who's very egotistical. They think they got it like that. Okay, this person could be financially well off. So, you know, they're used to getting what they want. Acceptance, the truth, just Yeah, they think that you're going to accept them. The strength, the fire. Universe, give me one more card. So they're full of themselves, basically. Universe, give me one more card. What message do you have for Virgo? Okay, Pisces, I mean, Scorpio, the middle way. The line between opposite extremes. I feel like you had enough with that Scorpio energy. Like, you're changing. Okay, the shadows you too. You've seen them as a karmic. Okay. Okay, 
let's look here. Universe, give me a big card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? So there is fear, acceptance. And envy, general energy, and service. So yeah, this is them. They want you to accept whatever BS offer they're trying to give you. Um, they they are fearful that you will move on to better, okay? Um, and they are trying to block you, okay? It's kind of like trying to cock block you, okay? Um, trying to be overly possessive. Let's see what this person would like to say. So you guys, give me a three card spread. The person that's on Virgo mind, what would you like to say to Virgo? Guilt, okay. So they would like to talk about how they wrong, but they feel like this connection could still work. This is a mess, okay? This is someone who know what they're doing and trying to see like, they wanna be with someone who's not gonna allow them to change. Like, Who's going to allow them to continue to be the same way. Okay. I feel like you are trying to bring out the best out of them. But it's like this person do not want to bring out the best out of them own selves. Okay. So they do see you as a good woman or a good man. Okay. But they know that they don't deserve you. Okay. So let's see here. Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? Okay, eight of wands, nine of cups. Universe, your wishes are coming true. Let's see what it's about. Spiritual strength. Yeah, so whatever you've been really putting your focus onto, you've been playing, meditating, it's coming through. A new beginning, ace of swords, trap and fear, which is the eight of swords. I feel like this could be clarity. This could be a breakthrough. Like you finally done with this person. Jenna energy is the fool, yeah. It's a breakthrough. You're done with this person who keeps playing games, who who's non like non-committed, non-faithful. Okay. So universe, give me a, a four card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? So there is Queen and Beggar. Like you yeah. You this is someone who's that don't deserve you was giving part of what you deserve basically you want the full thing virgin this is your energy universe give me one more card student yeah you take this as lesson learned lesson learned this person could be dealing with someone that they have a child with as well their baby mother baby father Okay, let's look at the other deck. Okay, so universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? Universe, give me a four card spread. So unlikely, remain positive. Universe, give me two more cards. What messages do you have for Virgos? Universe, give me two more cards. Communicate clearly. And it's up to you and proving how. Yeah, I feel like most of you guys make a decision just to walk away because you know that this is someone who's not willing to change. It's more so they want to deal with someone who's going to accept their BS. And they're thinking for some reason you're going to accept their BS. And it could be because you guys have been dealing with each other for a while. But you're breaking out of this cycle. Okay. And you're going to communicate that to them. And you are going to see like things are going to get much better for you guys. Have more peace, clarity. Okay. So... Let's see what else I'm getting. All right, so universe, give me a two card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? Universe, self belief. Universe, give me one more card. And shining bright. Yeah. So I feel like you guys are, you you are doing you. Okay. You are attracting a lot of people. You're not gonna get stuck. You're not gonna stuck, get stuck on them, okay? And then, yep, you are establishing healthy boundaries when it comes to this person and anybody who's like this energy, okay? So my clear boundaries allow me to protect myself, nurture my intentions, and follow my true self. Then there is self belief. Self belief is the magic key that opens up a better, more inspired future for me. 
and then there is shining bright i shine my light and allow my creative power to burn bright okay so that's the reading that i have for you virgos thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing if this video resonates you can definitely book a personal reading with me at queen for the tarot at gmail.com